welcome to our channel in this session we will discuss implementation of three address code simply the three address code is an abstract form of intermediate code and this intermediate code is implemented as a record this intermediate code is implemented as a record with the address fields now these three address codes is implemented or represented by using three ways the first one is quadruples the second one is triples the third one is indirect triples these are the three ways of representing intermediate code now we will discuss each and everything with an example the first one is quadruples okay here the quadruple simply it is a structure in the simple sense it is a record structure with four fields that means each and every record consists of four fields so what are the four fields the four fields are operator argument 1 argument 2 and the fourth field is result these are the four fields so we know what is the meaning of each and every one simply operator field this field contains the internal code for the operator that is which operation is to be performed that is specified in the op field now in between which parameters we are performing the operation those are specified in argument 1 and argument 2 that means here the op field contains the internal code for an operator similarly the argument 1 and argument 2 fields generally represents pointers to symbol table pointers to symbol table entries for the names that is between which variables we are performing the operations generally here the temporary names are also generated temporary names are also generated finally whatever the value we are getting that is stored in the result field the result field now consider one example and then is represented in quadruple form suppose my input statement is x is equal to minus a into b plus minus a into b the same expression what we discussed in the previous session now what is the first step the first step is generate three address code actually this is not required suppose if you are generating three address code it is very easy to represent in different forms so how do you write the different three address code t1 i am using the temporary variables also t1 here first to minus a assume unary minus a t2 is equal to t1 into b t1 into b now t3 is equal to unary minus again a t4 is equal to t3 into b that is this one into this one now this entire thing this value is placed in t2 this value is placed in t4 now perform addition between t2 and t4 finally the result is assigned to x x is equal to t5 this is three address representation now what is your aim represent in quadruple form okay so how many fields it consists of it consists of four fields op argument 1 argument 2 and then result consists of four fields so step by step perform all the operations first what we are doing unary minus first we are performing unary minus 
on a so your operator is unary minus here your argument is one a here we have only one argument after completion the result is stored in the t1 variable right now the next step is your operator is multiplication here the operation is performed between t1 and b so my first argument is t1 my second argument is b2 and the result is stored in the variable t2 result is stored in the variable t2 now t3 this one here my operation is unary minus and the argument is only one argument the result is stored in t3 the result is stored in t3 next to my operation is multiplication it is performed between t3 and 4 b the result is t4 plus performed between t2 and t4 the result is t5 and last one assignment operation here only one argument the result is stored in x so we are representing with indexes 0 1 2 3 4 Hi. These are the steps. This is the quadruple representation for the given expression. For the given expression. Now, uh, moving into the second one. What is the second one? The second one is triples. Simply, simple thing is a triple representation in the sense it consists of only three fields. It consists of only three fields in this we are avoiding we are avoiding temporary names into symbol table assume this is the symbol table this is the symbol table in the symbol table in the uh, quadruple we are writing the temporary variables but in the triples we are avoiding the temporary names in the symbol table so the temporary variables instead of writing how do you write the logic the temporary variables are referred by the position of the statement simply the temporary variables are referred by the position of the statements that computes okay now i will explain with one example so again i am repeating that triple in the sense it consists of only three fields operator argument 1 and argument 2 now write down the same example for the same example write down the triple representation number that is the statement number instead of writing temporary variables in the right symbol table we are using the statement number op argument 1 and argument 2 observe carefully 0 what is my first one unary minus my first one operator is unary minus and argument is a here i does not have any result field it does not have any result field my next statement is here you are performing multiplication between the arguments t1 and b what is t1 t1 is unary minus a that means this unary minus a is present in statement 0 that means directly you are writing this one into b i think you got it here instead of writing the temporary variable i am writing the statement number for example in the next line you are performing again unary minus on a next what is the next statement performing multiplication between t3 and b so b is fine what is t3 unary minus a that is present in statement number 2 that is present in statement number 2 next to the fourth statement here performing addition addition is performed between t2 t4 now t2 is present at this one t4 is present at this one simply 1 and 
finally fifth one assignment the result is placed in x uh, it is present in statement 4 you got it simply the variation instead of writing the temporary variable in the symbol table i am using the statement number this is called triple representation triple representation now move back to moving to uh, instead of moving back direct move to the third one indirect triples the third one is indirect triples in this indirect triple representation the listing of triples the listing of triples is performed what is mean by this one list whatever the triple representation we are using the same thing is performed in indirect representation along with in indirect the listing of pointers are used the listing of pointers are used instead of instead of using statements what is the meaning here in the previous one for representation we are using the statement number but in the indirect triple in indirect triple instead of using statement number we are using the listing of pointers listing of pointers so for example consider the previous first i am constructing a pointer table first i am constructing a pointer table this table consists of 0 1 2 3 4 5 how many number of statements we have we have 0 to 5 statements so 0 to 5 numbers now those are represented as assume you can start from any number not only 11 you can start from any number 13 14 15 16 so here this is the representation what is the meaning of this one instead of writing 0 from now onwards where 0 statement that is represented with 11 suppose consider the example number op1 argument 1 not op1 op argument 1 argument 2 so my first one is 0 write down parallelly 0 unary minus a that is fine there is no problem unary minus and a my second statement is statement 1 star 0 in the indirect representation here instead of this 0 we are referring the pointer so 0 is referred by using the 11 this is the meaning so in the next step 1 star instead of 0 we are using 11 now what is my next one 2 unary minus a my next step is 2 unary minus a so my next step is exactly star this statement i think this one 2 this one 2 instead of 2 we are writing 13 instead of 2 we are writing 13 b and the next one is plus between 1 and 3 between 1 and 3 1 and 3 in the sense here you are writing 12 and 14 i think you got it instead of writing the number here we are writing the pointer reference and finally in the last step we are assigning x the number 4 number 4 in the sense 15 this is the indirect triple representation indirect triple representation okay these are the different implementations of three address code thank you